Hello everybody and welcome! First of all, thank you so very much for stopping by. Thank you for watching my channel Ivana Tero. This is weekly tarot reading for astrological sign Pisces for both men and women all over the world being born under this sign. My dear friends, as usual, we have five tarot cards in front of my camera and my job is to translate every single tarot symbol which lies in front of you. So what type of energies you can expect, what type of people, events, news or information, you know, something entering, maybe something exiting from your life, you know, we will see together in the next couple of seconds. My dear friends, if you are completely new on my YouTube channel, first of all, welcome. Second of all, I do recommend to you go and watch weekly tarot reading for your moon sign and for your rising sun as well. Because, because it helps, believe me, it helps. Okay, my dear Pisces, let's get started. Let us try to see together what you can expect in new upcoming week, December 4th until December 10th, 2017. Okay, let's get started. My dear Pisces, you will start your new upcoming week with energy coming from Major Arcana Death and do not be afraid because I will explain to you everything what I can see. Ace of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Prince of Cups and Major Arcana, the Wheel of Fortune. So what is going now? Now, maybe this is the most important, my dear Pisces, after so many times, after so many years, maybe, you know, you will learn how to say no. And if you think uh, that this is uh, superficial, it is not. Because I think that you need to deal with, you know, learning how to say no. Because, you know, uh, you always tend to say yes, but now you will learn how to say no. And this is, you know, uh, this is big something which is now happening in your life. Ace of Pentacles is beautiful tarot card. This is earth element, this is money, this is job, this is communication about uh, investment, this is communication about real estate, money in general. Maybe somebody want uh, to take some money from you and now maybe for the very first time in your life you will say no, no, no. So try to understand this is big subject in your life. How to say no. I helped you how many times? Try to recall. 3, 5, 10, 20, 30 times and nothing. So honey, now it's time for you to learn your lesson. This is your words addressing you to somebody else. Mm -hmm. And if you think that uh, that this is, you know, something uh, small. It is not small. This is big. Maybe this is you talking with your ex, saying to your ex, no. What? What do you mean no? But you loved me. You adored me. Yeah, honey. Uh-huh. In past time. But you see, now is new day. Now is new life of mine. Now is, you know, new rules, which basically you are setting for yourself. Queen of Swords is Libra, uh, Gemini or an Aquarius. This is somebody who is already in your life. Hopefully you are in a happy relationship with this Libra, Gemini or an Aquarius. Maybe this is somebody who is trying uh, to, uh, to take uh, your attention. Maybe this is somebody who are using completely false and wrong, not false, but wrong, tactic, strategy to seduce you. Try to remind yourself, you really need, you know, somebody who will take care of you, somebody who will love you, somebody who will be very, very supportive. I have uh, news for you. Uh, in your space, in your neighborhood, in your office, shop, factory, or basically whenever you are spending your time, could be in your gym, could be, I don't know, whatever, there is your fellow sign, a Pisces, there is a Cancer Scorpio, very interested, interested into you. But this person is quite very similar to you. This person have a big, big, big issue of approaching to woman who basically heart of his desire for you. So this is like a big topic. 
Now, you need to meet somebody who is very, very similar to you. When it comes to love relationship, this person cannot simply express his feelings because, you know, now, especially now, when you finally learn how to say no, everybody will see that. Everybody will have, you know, a difficult time to approach to you. Also, there is a sense that you are very angry about something or somebody. Honey, calm yourself down. Don't use people who are really not involved in this dispute, uh, you know, to be affected by your anger. Try not to do that. Also, if you are in a very, 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 very bad situation, if you know for sure that you can provide for, for yourself, if you know for sure that you, that you really don't love somebody who is now next to you, this is finally saying, you know, I am cutting you off finally from my life. This is finally, finally no. So whether you like it or not, this is you um, clearing your life from all kinds of people who are really not serving your higher good, people who are really with you from a couple of completely wrong reasons. You can feel that. You know that. Now you are sure and you will cut all ties with the false friends, with the false love um, partners in your life. So, honey, uh, the key word, um, mm, 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 the overall story for you is free yourself, cut all ties with people who are not any more good for you, embrace your new power because new power is um, uh, coming in you, uh, be very, very firm, be courageous and even in your office, you know, fight for what you want. There, is, there are no gifts for you. You need to fight for what you want to achieve. So, first of all, do not be afraid of anything at all because there is nothing you should be afraid. But you need to make a space, completely new space, free space all around you so you can, so you can invite somebody new in your life. This is exactly what is going on with you. The final tarot card in your spread is Major Arcana, the Wheel of Fortune. Fortune is awaiting. Destiny of yours is going to be changed. But now, honey, you need to be ready to meet your destiny. And please don't start freaking out on me because there is nothing you should freaking about. And I mean it. Nothing. So this is you changing first and foremost yourself this is you changing as a woman this is you changing as a man if you're male Pisces watching this video and learning finally how to say no to maybe even not only one person this could be bunch of people using your talent using uh, your money using your time and above all your energy and your strength do not be afraid Try to be like a queen of swords, setting yourself free from all kinds of BS in your life. Okay, by the end of this reading, there is another, uh, another message from completely another tarot deck of mine. Now, what we have in here, the waiting time, but honey, listen to me, the waiting time is over. This is over. You do not want to wait, you know, somebody to occur and because, you know, most likely somebody will occur begging you, give me another chance, give me another chance, give me another chance. But this is you saying, you know, honey, I'm sorry, waiting again with me is over. There is nothing I want or, you know, I could or I should say to you. This is like, you know, the waiting game is over. Big, big time. Okay, let me add only one thing. Honey, now you can really be very, very proud of who you become. The last couple of months, maybe even years, was not that um, uh, easy for you. But now you are changing your course. You are changing even type of people uh, with whom basically you want to be connected with. Okay, my dear friends, my dear pastors, this is everything what I have to say for this upcoming week. Pretty strong and intense week is in front of you. Embrace new power which is given to you. Never allow anymore somebody else to 
use and abuse your kindness. Simply don't do that anymore. But if you want to hear a story of your own, then please book a private reading with me. You will get tarot reading, astrology reading for the price of one. I wish you all the best. God bless you all. Bye.